I want to talk about Puerto Rico and just the situation that's going on right now in the island. Everybody's in protest. Everybody's trying their best to just take out the governor from Puerto Rico because so much has happened in these past three days and nobody really wants him here no more. They don't want him as a governor and I, I have to agree. I wouldn't want, I don't want him as a governor either and it just sucks. The reason I'm making this video is just to keep some other people informed. There's not a lot of videos out there explaining what's going on and why is this a big deal or an issue and it's pretty simple to be honest. There's a leak on the government's uh, private group chat that him and a little more people from the government party or whatever it was that were just making fun of the people of Puerto Rico. And it's just insane to have somebody in power, somebody that you put your trust in that was selected by the people to just betray you and just talk shit about you behind closed doors. It's something so unfair and something that's so unnecessary at this point. And at this time, Puerto Rico just, on 2017, they suffered a pretty bad hurricane where a lot of people died and to them it was just a joke. There's a lot of screenshots. There's a lot of conversations of them just joking around and messing around and just talking about people's death as if they're just meaningless and they didn't matter. They even made fun of a reporter that also died. And it's just like so inhumane and so shitty to have somebody like to have the highest ranked official just treat you and treat the people like if they're nothing, like they don't matter. And other than that, I mean, there's so much that, that those leaked uh, conversations showed. It showed a lot of information. It showed it showed them making, like I said, a lot of jokes about Maria. They were making homophobic jokes. They even, they talked about Rick and Martin. Rick and Martin. They were talking about, every, like, they were just making fun of everything, basically. And if they were not making fun of it, they were just being assholes about shit that's not even, like, a topic to make fun of or anything like that. And a lot of people, yeah, they can say there was a private conversation, but the, he's the highest official in Puerto Rico. And to, for him to have a conversation like that, talking about him trying to kill the mayor, or him being okay with, with, with somebody offering to kill the mayor, saying that you would do me a favor. Him having conversations about how cojamos de pendejo todo nuestro, which basically translates to even our own, we, we trick them. And then he just, it's obvious and it makes sense why nobody wants him no more. And they want him to quit. They want him to resign. They don't want him to be in office no more because we don't need somebody like him in office. Somebody that just came from a vacation even though Puerto Rico's suffering. And to the point not to care about Puerto Rico and even have corrupt officials that were working with him. The, even the FBI had to step, on, step in and we don't even know what's next because he doesn't even want to leave. He has the audacity to not leave. He thinks that the Puerto Rican people are gonna be okay with that and that this is gonna stop. And this is just starting. It's gonna get worse. It's not gonna be easy, but we're gonna pull through. We always do. And we're gonna do it together. That's the best thing we, we do. Like brothers and sisters from the same island, we do it. And we're gonna make it happen. He doesn't wanna quit, we're gonna make him quit. And the people are going to do that. And it doesn't matter if you're an artist, if you're not an artist, everybody that comes from there, tiene su patria y ama su patria. And they're gonna make it happen, one way or another. And it's sad because even the police don't even want to help him out, but they have to do their job. It's sad that, that it had to come to basically a riot down there. There's a lot of artists that come from Puerto Rico, and right now there's a lot of them showing support. And even they're even in the protest protest right now. And they're not they're not in the pro protests as artists. They're in the protests as people. We're all trying our best to help Puerto Rico as people from wherever we're at. Because el Puerto Rico viene del corazón, and we will always love home. Mm -hmm.